Nice. That's hot. What what is going on? Is it just me? Or does anybody know what's going on? Is it just me who's pretending? That's what I'm asking. Does anybody else have any idea what's going on right now? I'm pretty sure I haven't known for about the last... Let's say 20 years! Does anybody have any idea what's going on? Like a clue. Um, I don't. You wake up in the morning. Uh, you you poop. Then you get out of bed. Just kidding. You go poop. Uh, you brush your teeth. Well, you probably eat first. You eat, brush your teeth. Come to your computer. You check the news. Things are getting worse. <laughs> I probably should cut out the check the news part. That would probably be a good start. Things, things are getting worse already. So, I open up free games on Steam. I go through all the free games. I got, you know what, I'm gonna check right now. I'm gonna open up my fucking um, thing and see. Yeah, yeah, I got a bunch of raffle things. I go on free games on Steam. Then I go on steamgifts.com. <laughs> just giveaways, and I enter all of them. I enter all the ones I can enter. I do that for the recommended ones, not just my wish list ones. Uh, I don't really do that. I look at the Amazon Prime thing, because my family has that. I do that. Uh, free game stuff on Reddit. I have my wait list on Is There Any Deal? Wow, I like games. I enter the Mega Raffle on the DF2 uh, Mega Raffle giveaway. I go, I look on the petitions. Um, on UK pensions, I go through anything that's like, yeah, this sounds good. Maybe I'll read a little bit about that, and then I'll sign one of those, and I'll I'll go through my email and I'll take them all off. That that makes me feel a little better. Better. I do that like probably, I probably don't do that every day though. Um, yeah, I do that. I wake up in the morning, I do that, and then probably by then it's probably like nine thirty. Got the shit I need to do, and then I go into uni. Um, and it's like I'm 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 chugging along. I'm probably a little bit behind, you know, and that's okay. Take some time. It's a little bit stressy, but take some time to pick things up and go forward. It's pretty normal, I think, for some people at least. People like me, at least, who aren't all that switched on. And you just do all that, but the bar's set really low. But I'm still not really like getting any big wins, you know? The bar is set very low, like when you hear about what people are doing around the planet. It's not that great. So I'm gonna go back a little further. So you're born. <laughs> that was your first mistake, buddy. Oh, good instant coffee. That was your first mistake. You were born. Um, nobody asked. Nobody asked me, but also nobody asked you if that was okay. It kind of just happened. Uh, some people, um, even in some cases, people would be like, I should not have kids. And then they have kids. And then that's you. And it's like, oh, you're having a bad time. Not me, not my personal experience. Um, things, Everything was set up great for me, and I still messed up. So... That's fine though. You know what I you know what I mean by that. That's fine. You you either bought into two groups. You Kim Kardashian or you're everybody else. And when you're everybody else, you need to work to make money. Uh I'm somewhere in the middle where I'm still in education, but somehow, somehow, I've had I have worked. And it's not good, is it? Anyone who has worked doing something they don't enjoy to make money can say it, it, it pretty much makes you miserable um, unless you're doing something you really enjoy just so like nine times out of ten things are pretty bad and you, you if you're born into being one of those Kim Kardashian people you get your toes sucked and you do all that and you have enough the effective power to make change in the world but you don't because they and your toes get 
not sucked and you have to work. And you see the problem is there that we kind of locked ourselves in a little bit. And it's like, yeah, we've we've weaned away at it a bit. I think we've done a little bit better since the 50s, but it's not going that great. I think things are getting a bit worse again. I'm not going to show you any numbers or data that says that. This is purely anecdotal, but it feels a little bit like things are getting worse, especially recently. I think I remember... 2019 was the last year I ever heard someone say, this is going to be my year. I don't think we do that anymore. <laughs> it's it's pretty funny. Um, I, I don't know where I'm going with this, but actually I do a little bit. What's going on? I don't have a clue what's going on or what we're going to do about it. Things kind of just seem to be getting worse. And then there's those some people who are like, Anyone who, like, is authentic about it and says, we all need to group together and rise up against this un injustice. When? Shouldn't we have done that by now? We're not really organized, are we? No one's put me in the WhatsApp group that says we're all going to stop this and that, you know? Like, stop shop. Like, what do I do? I stop getting meal deals at Tesco? That's the cheapest one. It's £3.50. It's gone up in price. The last video I made where I said, everything's going to be okay. <laughs> so everything's going to be okay. I'm going to go get a meal deal. Went to Tesco. It's £3.50 now. It's over. We hit, we hit our limit a long time ago. I reckon it was like when I was like... 15? I hit, I hit a good point. Yeah, now it's pretty much downhill from there. Uh, so I don't know what we're going to do now. I don't just mean me. Because I'm just kind of going to sail through and, and do what I can. I'm warming up to it. Just got out of COVID. Feel a lot better. You appreciate being able to breathe through both nostrils when you get that taken away from you. But like, what are we doing? What's going on? Does anybody know? I I don't even have to list things off. Like... We're all here. We all live here. Like, not here, but... My, like... My suggestion is if is if you're the other guy with the nukes, send them over. Like, so what? You said you were going to do it. And then we retaliated, and then you didn't do it. Why Why not? So come on, send them over. If you don't... I'm going to give you... You know what? I'm going to give you 20 more seconds. And if they don't come in twenty more seconds, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a little bit upset. I might even raise my voice. <laughs> Let's see. I wasn't really taking count. No. Nope. I'll check out the window. I don't see anything. I don't hear anything. I don't hear any planes. I'm starting to think you're not gonna send them. So just fuck off. You know? Things are bad enough as is. So just go away. Still not there. Like, come on. Okay, dude. What now? Do you have any fucking clue what's going on? I wonder if there's anybody on the planet who has, like, enough money to end world hunger or anything like that. Like, right now. That would be really cool. Maybe I'll Google that. Maybe I'll look that up real quick. Let's find out. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! Maybe I won't do that, okay? Because maybe I already know, and I was being hypothetical. Things, think, I'm starting to think things aren't going to get better. Not for a little while, at least. That's my genuine, authentic opinion. I'm going to keep going, because what else am I going to do? I'm not going to kill myself. That's... Been there, done that. That's not happening. Why would that be sensible? Why would that make anything any better? It was never up to me, anyway. What are your options? Really think about it. Like, if you're having a bad time, really think about what your options are. You're just going to have to keep going. And it might get better. It probably won't. I'm not going to lie to you. It probably won't get better. Things probably won't get better. Not for a long time. But the options are, they either do or they don't. And if they do get better, you want to be around for that. So just fucking keep going. You fucking pussy. <laughs> I 
I don't know what's going on. And I'm not looking forward to finding out. If you want to tell me, I'm asking. I'm genuinely asking. I care. I give a fuck. That's my kind of my thing. That's kind of my bit, is that I actually care. So if you want to tell me what's going on. And just come on, like... I've, I've been trying it. Give me some leeway. I'm not asking you. I'm asking you. You know, not 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 him. I know I don't even know about that. But like, I mean, like, just chuck us a fiver or something. Honestly, and if if you're like listening to that, saying, "Oh, I'd send you a fuck," please don't, because you clearly need that. Because anybody who would give someone a fiver. If you've never given someone a fiver in your life, and you have almost all of the fivers, and I'm saying like, imagine all the fivers in the world, and you've got more than 50% of them, probably should chuck one of those, like someone else's way. Not even mine. I'm going to look someone up. Say, who's having a bad day? I'm having an okay day. Who's having a bad day today? And you'll find some like kid uh, in some country you've never heard of, who got both their legs blown off. Um, because, <laughs> because they said, because they waved a little like flag of their country. That's a little bit much. Get your fucking legs and parts blown off. I, I mean like, fair enough. I'd be upset if someone waved their flag at me too. I, I, I'd probably, yeah, I can validate like blowing someone's legs off or something like that. Real reasonable, real smart. Not very insecure of you at all. What's going on? Anybody? No? Okay. See me after class, alright? Because I don't have... I'm not wearing a watch. I don't know why I did that. Oh, yeah, I think we'll leave it at that. That's pretty good.